In this video, I will demonstrate how to use the SnapLogic Fast Data Loader. The SnapLogic Fast Data Loader helps you quickly load data to cloud data warehouses such as Amazon Redshift and Snowflake. Today, I will show an example of moving an entire Oracle schema to Snowflake with very little configuration. Once you log in to the SnapLogic Fast Data Loader, you will first select what type of database you wish to pull data from. In this demo, I will select Oracle. Once the database type is selected, the Fast Data Loader will display accounts associated with that database type that already exist for your account. Or you can create a new account by selecting Add Account from the dropdown and clicking the Create Account button. The label property is simply the name you want displayed in the dropdown list. Note that the account used to read from your source system needs permissions to read the catalog information and read access to the tables you select for replication. Since I have already created an Oracle account, I will select that and click Submit. The SnapLogic Fast Data Loader is now analyzing the source system, generating a list of all available schemas and tables. When the analysis is completed, a drop-down list of the available schemas in the source system is displayed along with how many tables exist in each schema. I will select the source schema I want to replicate and click Submit. I will now select the target cloud data warehouse as Snowflake for this demo. You can create a new account the same way as in the source account section by selecting Add Account in the drop-down list and clicking the Create Account button. Note that the account used to write to the target system requires permissions to create schemas and tables and perform bulk data load operations. Since I have already created a Snowflake account, I will select that and click Submit. The SnapLogic Fast Data Loader is now analyzing the target system, generating a list of all available schemas. The same analysis of metadata is performed on the target system as it was on the source system. During the replication process, Table definitions are compared and synchronized to ensure that the replicated data can be fully loaded. For example, any tables loaded to the source system will be added to the target system, or if a new column is added to a source table, the Fast Data Loader will add the new column to the target table before loading any data. When the target database analysis has completed, a drop-down list of all of the available schemas in the target system is displayed along with how many tables exist in each schema. You can select an existing schema to replicate, or you can create a new schema by selecting Add Schema from the drop-down list, entering a schema name in the text box, and clicking Select Schema. I will choose my target schema and click Submit. Now that the source and target accounts have been created and schemas have been selected, the Fast Data Loader will perform a further analysis of the source schema to provide a list of tables and replication options. Each table can be individually selected for replication and the load method type to be used. Reload means that the table will be truncated at the start of replication and fully replicated. Upsert means that it will insert new records and update existing records. And SCD2 means that it will maintain records in the target table with effective begin and end dates and a current record flag. Note that if you have a table with slowly changing logic in your source system, you should use reload or upsert as the load method. I will leave reload as my desired load method, select the tables that I want to replicate, and click Submit. The Fast Data Loader executes in the background and you will receive an email notification when the process has completed. The email body provides a summary of the actions and details are provided in an attached Excel spreadsheet. Once you receive the completion email, you can check your target instance to review the tables that have been created and loaded. Note that the target tables have been created with additional columns that the FAST data loader uses, and all source columns are replicated with equivalent data types in the target system. Thank you for watching this walkthrough of the SnapLogic Fast Data Loader. If you would like to try the Fast Data Loader, please visit get.snaplogic.com forward slash fast dash loader.